meet our good friend. I'm gonna call her JB. She's a my econ associate. The first thing Jeanette did, just so you understand, she was two hundred and fifty thousand in debt. Two hundred and fifty thousand. Jeanette adjusted her W-4. Her W-4 gave her an increase of $1,100 per month instantly in her own paycheck. Just by changing the what? The form. Her check went up $1,100 per month. Now, by correcting her behavior in the software, she cut her expenses by $1,900. The going out to eat the late fees, all the stuff I was telling you about that add up on you by entering all her information into our software and seeing exactly where her money was what was going. Now she's 3000 cash flow positive, right? She's got cash flow success now. She took the $3,000. Her debt was 1600 a month was the interest, the student loans, the credit cards. She took the 3,000 and instead of sending 1,600 a month, you start sending 3,000 per what? Month. So she got rid of all her debt in about two and a half years using her own 3,000 what? Dollars. Now she got, she's positive 40 what? 46. Her mortgage is 1,900 a month. Now, instead of sending a mortgage company $1,900 a month, she's sending them $46 of her own what? Money. Now, you mess around, instead of sending the mortgage the regular payment, send them three and four times the payment. She cut her mortgage in 3.5 years. Her mortgage was gone. Now, she positive $6,500 per what? Jeanette started investing every single month. She now has $600,000 in her retirement. And between her and her husband, they got about 1.2 in assets. From strategy one, creating her own positive cash flow and rolling that bad boy over into strategy number what? Number three. I haven't even shown you guys strategy two yet. I'm just introducing you to what's called income shifting. Once you get your money back from the people that's taking it from you, then you double down on everything that's keeping you from getting rich. It don't take a lot of money to get rich, guys. Everybody in this room can make five or $6,000 tax-free and start investing it properly. You have five or $600,000 in your savings. And that brings you about five or 6,000, you have five or $600,000 in your savings. And they say, you need about 10 times the amount of your monthly um, expenses in your retirement account. So if you need $5,000 a month to live, you need $500,000 in your what? Retirement. So 10% of $500,000 is $50,000. Make sense? And that's your $5,000 roughly per what? Per month. So now she don't do nothing else. Jeanette was $250,000 in debt and flipped it around. Now, here's what most people are going to say. I go out here and adjust my W-4, I'm going to owe. Glad you said that. <laughs> no, you're not. First of all, you only took one part of the strategy. We got a three-tier what? Strategy. The, be the best thing you can ever invest in is a business. See, our business is showing people this strategy. So by the mere fact that she became a My Econ associate, we train you, we have videos, we got a website, you're doing it yourself, you're showing people the strategy, you now have a home-based what? Home-based business. Now, here's how this works. This is real simple. We're going to take this person right here, and we're going to move over into strategy two. This person made $50,000, but really only took home what? Fourteen. Now that you have a home-based business, certain things become write-offs, right? So now, you got your job. Same person making $50,000 a year on their job, right? Now watch this. I got a percentage of my mortgage interest. 
a percentage of my square footage because I have a home base what? Business. A percentage of my cell phone what? Bill. Percentage of the gas in my car. That's car. Petroleum. <laughs> percentage of my gas bill at home. Percentage of my internet. Percentage of my vacations. Percentage of my meals. In other words, my lifestyle that I'm doing every day anyway, I can now what? Deduct. So I'm going to take the 14000 that I spend on my lifestyle what? Anyway, the government says over here, you spend second and pay taxes last. So I'm going to take the 50000 subtract the what? Subtract the 14. I'm going to take the 14 out. Now y'all can only tax me on what? 36. And guess what? It's getting taxed less. So you got a choice, guys. You can either give the government 30% of 50,000 or give the government 15% of 36,000. Because you're going to do this right here anyway. <laughs> See, that's the beauty of a home-based business. See, in a traditional, regular business, you got to go out and create these expenses. In other words, I got to, me and you open up a t-shirt shop, Maurice. Me and you going to go out and get a t-shirt shop, but now we got a brand new what? Building with a brand new lease, with brand new equipment, with brand new marketing. So traditional business is cool when you get a lot of write-offs, but it's write-offs that you didn't have before you got the business. In a home-based business, you write off your life what? Style. So now, if my lifestyle is 14000 the government says, you know what? Subtract that. You made fifty. take fourteen off because we need you to stay in what? We need you to stay in business. Now we're going to tax you on 36. And 36 is way less than 50. And 15% is way less than 28. So guess what? This home-based business alone just put anywhere from eight to $10,000 in my pocket. That's called income shifting. But guess what? I haven't made a dime. Did I lose anybody? I didn't bring in any extra currency. I just gave less away. Because we still make 50 what? Thousand. It's just that my home-based business allowed me to do some things that the W-2 won't let me what? Won't let me do. So I put eight to ten thousand dollars back in my pocket. The difference between the 36 getting taxed and the 50 getting taxed goes in my account. Because I'm no longer giving it what? Away. See, the problem with people is too many people think the answer to all their problems is I gotta sell something. I gotta hustle some product. I got to make some more money. I got to get in this company and do that and get commissions. It's not. You can use a strategy to make you more money with the money you currently bringing in. Now, let me ask y'all a question. If you know somebody who needs to know the strategy on increasing their own money, raise your hand. For showing them that strategy, we pay you. So within our business, we wrapped a referral model of showing people this strategy. Now, let me tell you something. I got the worst penmanship in the world, and my board looked like trash. But who understands everything I just said? <laughs> I'm not the most articulate. I ain't the best speaker in the world. I'm not the biggest accountant in the world. I don't have a, a, a degree being a, um, an accountant in finance and all that. I just understand one thing. This dude pay the most. This dude pay less. Money pay the least. We need to stop paying so much here and find our way to shift some money over here and get a government less money. That I understand, and I don't need no degree to do that. So how do we do it? I'm glad you asked.